Shalom, shalom, Yashirala. All praises and glory goes to our mighty power, Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh, Shai, Bashem, Rakakudash. Double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone, citation unto the legend and feeding the sheep of Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh, Shai, in sincerity and truth through this great gospel. And on the water, Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh, Shai, for this knowledge, wisdom, and understanding to feed the elect. Because that's what the wisdom was given to us for, to feed the elect of Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh, Shai. And um, this lesson is inspired first through Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh, Shai, but also through the the spirit had put on um, Apostle Gabar to speak about the numerology of the number 12, right? Because he had said something about the number 12, the meaning behind it, right? The symbolism behind the number 12, right? Let's get this. Here it says, intriguing insights, right? Intriguing insights, exploring the meaning of the numerology of number 12, right? Because number 12 is found a lot in the Bible, <laughs> It's found a lot in the Bible. As a matter of fact, let's get some scriptures going into this 12. I'm going to start off with Matthew 10 and 5. It says, In these 12, these 12, Yahweh Shai sent forth and commanded them, saying, Go not into the way of the Gentiles, and into any city of the Samaritans, enter ye not, but go rather to the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Right? These 12. And let's go into the meaning of the number 12. It says the word numerology comes from the Latin word numerous, which means number, and Greek word logos, which means word, thought, or expression, right? It reads here, the number 12 can be found in 164 places in the King James Version of the Bible. Aside from being considered a perfect number by many scholars, 12 has several biblical meanings. The number 12 represents perfect governmental foundation, right? And who would the Lord had 12 tribes, <laughs> right? The 12 tribes of Israel. He sent out 12 disciples, <laughs> right? When you go into the book of Revelation, what else did the Lord say? It's the book of Revelation 7, verse 1, and it reads, And after these things I saw four angels standing on the four corners of the earth, holding the four winds of the earth, that the wind should not blow on the earth, nor on the sea, nor on any tree. And I saw another angel ascending from the east, having the seal of the living power, and cried with a loud voice to the four angels to whom it was given to hurt the earth and the sea, saying, Hurt not the earth, neither the sea nor the trees, till we seal the servants of the Most High in their foreheads. And after I heard the number of them which were sealed, it reads, And there were sealed, what? And 144,000 of all the tribes of the children of Israel. Of the tribe of Judah were sealed, 12,000. Of the tribe of Reuben sealed, 12,000. Of the tribe of Gad were sealed, 12,000. Right? You see the <coughs> repetition, the number 12? It says what? I'll read it again. It says the number 12 can be found in 164 places in the King James Version of the Bible, aside from being considered a perfect number by many scholars, right? 12 hours for the day, 12 hours for the night, right? And they also use the number 12 spiritually, right? You got a dozen eggs, right? They also talk about the dirty dozens. Right, the number twelve pops up spiritually a lot. Even in this world, you got Esau. I mean, on um, the two thirds saying "fuck twelve. The police they don't gave him the name twelve. Right? It says number by many scholars. Twelve has several biblical meanings. The number twelve represents perfect government foundation. Twelve sons of Jacob of Israel were the princes who represented the twelve tribes. Read the book of Revelation 21 and 9. And there came unto me one of the seven angels which had seven vows full of the seven last plagues. That's another number the Lord's dealing with too, that seven, which means completion. And talked with me, saying, Come hither, I will show thee the bride, the lamb's wife. And he carried me away in the spirit to a great and high mountain and showed me that great city, the holy Jerusalem descending out of heaven from the Most High having the glory of the Most High, and her light was like unto a stone most precious, even like a jasper stone, clear as crystals. Right? And you see it in that movie. Um, <laughs> They try to re-mimic these, these biblical writings in the movie um, Clash of the Titans. 
where they had the fake ass God sitting on top looking down on earth <laughs> where it says the earth is my footstool they're standing on top of the earth and looking down and it says and he had a great wall and a high twelve gates and all the gates twelve angels <laughs> read that again and had a wall great and high and a twelve and had twelve gates at the gates twelve angels and names written thereon were on the names of the twelve tribes of what the children of Israel. Right? You see, the Lord is dealing with that number twelve, because Esau understands what that twelve means. I'm reading this. It says, um, meaning of numbers, number twelve. The English word twelve used for for the number twelve is recorded one hundred and eighty-nine times in one hundred and sixty-five in King James Bible verses. It occurs one hundred and fourteen times in the Old Testament. And that's seventy-five occurrences in the New Testament. The word twelfth is found an additional twenty-three times in scriptures. The number twelve is one of the foundations of scripture. The meaning of the twelfth is that it symbolizes the most high's power. Yahabashim Yahshai's power and authority as well as serving as a perfect government foundation it can also symbolize complete completeness of the nation of israel as a whole <laughs> as a whole right what is god's strange plan it says jacob's israel had 12 sons each which represent a tribe right we already went into that we're going to go to um, what else does the number 12 signify? It says the number 12 is numerology. The number 12 in numerology, what it signifies. It says the number 12 in numerology may be an indicator of the following. The number 12 is associated with creativity, particularly from an expression of individuality and per perspectives, individuality and perspectives. It is linked to imagination, tolerance, communication, self-determination, self-sufficiency, optimism, cooperation, and dynamis, dynam, dynamism. The number 12 is a social and can imagine and manifest creativity. It can also inspire others with dynamism, dynamism and optimism alike it is usually tolerance and everything except except things that may stifle creative expression now that the symbol now that now that the symbolism behind the number 12 is numerology is evident let us take a closer look at what it implies for homeowners right so this is going into other things some shit that we ain't dealing with that type of numerology. We dealing with the twelve tribes of Israel, right? <laughs> we dealing with with the Lord, the twelve disciples the Lord sent out in the Bible. Twelve represents something, and spiritually, right? It says completion and harmony. The number twelve can represent the end of a cycle and the start of possibilities. Cosmic order. The twelve. The number twelve can symbolize perfection, integrity. Or cosmic order, the religious significance in Christianity. Number 12 is significant because these are the 12 apostles of Yahweh Shai, 12 months in a year. And 12 is a zodiac sign. The book of Revelation also mentions the number 12, including 12 angels and 12 gates. Right? Ancient Greek signify significance. The Greeks worship 12 major gods of Olympus. Babylonian significance. The Babylonians considered number 12 sacred in their zodiac also had 12 celestial signs. Chinese significance. In ancient Chinese philosophy, there were 12 earthly branches, each linked to a different compass point. <laughs> right? So we see that there's some behind the number 12, man, spiritually and worldly. Shalom.